time. Oopsie Annie, and I'm in a hot spa with a view of the river. Look at the, look at the waterfall. Okay, I'm gonna stand up on the bench and show you our view of what we're seeing. There's the cliffs, there's the river, and if you look in close, you'll see some waterfalls. You see that? And here is our area. It's not fancy. No, but it's clean and it, nice. It's clean and nice. Mm -hmm. If you go out here through this door, there's a parking lot, there's campgrounds. Real sweet spot. And I'm gonna get a soak in in this therapeutic water. And Oopsie Annie is gonna feel real good. If I wanted to float on my back, I actually could. <laughs> I'm going to be 57 in a few days. And I'm telling you, I do have fibromyalgia and chronic fatigue. And I have found sitting in natural spring waters, therapeutic waters that come deep from the earth is definitely a healing, soothing experience. So that I can live another 20 years or more with lots of hiking, climbing, doing all those fun adventures I want to do, and stay strong enough and flexible enough to do it. from the soak. We could stay longer, but there's other places to go and see and do. And to tell you the truth, I get kind of not feeling so good when I'm in the hot water for a while, and an hour was a long time. So we actually got out, what, 45 minutes? We didn't stay for a full we did. hour. Almost a full hour. Oh, we did stay almost a full hour. Well, I was getting in and out of the water. But if we're gonna come back here again, and we do plan on coming back here again and again, I think the pool, is the place that we'll spend a lot of time in. It has a diving board. It goes to eight feet deep on the other end. And oh my gosh, it is wonderful. So we'll be back. As you can see, pets are allowed here too. Always a wonderful option to have for people like Jiffy Jeff and I who have our Bilbo wagon. We take him with us everywhere. Here we are now in a little picnic area and I'm gonna be quiet. I have no idea if you all are gonna be able to hear the waterfalls across the way. Let's see if I can show them to you at least. You see that? Waterfalls. I'm here at Balanced Rock. It's right up there. There it is. This is near Bull or Buell? B U H L. What does that pronounce? Bull. Buell. <laughs> so Jeff says I'm welcome to climb up there closer to it, but he's not going to. We left the spa earlier, so I feel like maybe my joints are good and loose. Try a little bit, see how high I go. I've learned here in Idaho that when you look at something, you think, oh, that doesn't look too bad. It's a lot steeper than you think it is. Guess what I'm learning? I'm learning that it's hard to angle a camera when you're trying to walk up a steep gravel path. So that's all you all are going to see of me climbing up this hill. I need both my hands to keep steady. 
Okay, I'm closer to it. And as I'm looking at it, some yahoos have spray painted on it, marked it. Right along a huge rock wall, a campground, a free campground. Campers can stay here for seven days straight. That's the limit, but in seven days you can really have a fabulous time. I briefly spotted a river otter swimming here, right beside the campground. been part one of my Oopsie Annie's birthday adventure. Thank you for stopping by and be sure to come back. There's lots more adventure waiting and until then, love life, be inspired, be grateful, birth joy. Ta-ta for now. Mwah!